Welcome back to the channel. I'm RJ Ryan Kilio. If you're new here, thanks for joining me. Firstly, I want to thank everyone that has already signed up for my new course, How to Play Slide Guitar. I hope you guys are enjoying it and learning some new stuff. If you haven't signed up yet, there is still a special launch deal happening. 75% off the course. Click the link in the description to take advantage of it. Okay, so one of the questions I've been getting asked a lot is learning slide in standard tuning versus an open tuning like open E, which is what I teach in my course. And while there's no right or wrong way to learn slide, I recommend players that are new to slide learn it in an open tuning first, and there's a few reasons why. So it seems that it would make more sense to learn slide in standard tuning, right? Because that's what we're all used to. We know where all the notes are. We're familiar with certain shapes and patterns already, etc. But the main reason I recommend an open tuning for beginners is simply this. It's easier to sound good faster in an open tuning. Now let me explain. So I've said this before in past videos. Open tuning slide is like playing a harmonica. As long as you're in the right key, there's no wrong notes. So on a harmonica, if you have a normal diatonic harmonica that's in the key of the song, all the notes, whether you inhale or exhale, are good notes. With slide playing in an open tuning, since it's tuned to an open chord, all the notes across one fret on the fingerboard are gonna be good notes. There's certain licks you can play easily on an open tuned guitar that you can't play in standard. For instance, a lick like this. Because we're tuned to a chord, you have these kind of triad groupings across all the strings, you know? But in standard tuning, you really only have one major triad inversion in these middle strings, the second, third, and fourth, which make kind of like a G major triad inversion. You have a fourth interval on the top two strings. But for me, having that major third from the uh, open E tuning, I think that really helps define slide blues guitar, you know? Which you can't really pull off in standard tuning. So because of this difference, I find that open tuning is a little more forgiving with regards to technique, which is a really good advantage to have for beginner slide players. For instance, in open tuning, you can get away with any two strings ringing at once. With standard tuning, you really have to concentrate on your right hand or your picking hand muting technique in order to play cleanly, going from note to note, like this. Notice I can't really do a lot of uh, chordal stuff like I could uh, in an open tuning. I can do this. But that's pretty much it. I'm pretty much limited to single note playing. Also, I'm a big proponent of when learning anything, whether it's a certain style or a certain tune, to learn it in the way it originated, meaning learning the first original version of a song or going back to the early days of a certain style. The very first slide players were most likely tuned to an open chord, whether it was Hawaiian slack key lap style players or Delta blues legends. So all of the classic licks that we're familiar with stem from an open tuned guitar. And if you're a fan of modern players like Derek Trucks or Ariel Posen, etc., it's a good idea to check out who influenced them. And I say all the time, if you really want to learn a player's style or vibe, you should learn about the players that influenced them as well. Okay, I hope that helped answer any of your questions regarding what tuning to start learning slide in. Again, if you're interested in learning slide guitar, my course How to Play Slide Guitar is available for a limited time, 75% off. Just click the link in the description to get started today. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.